Hey there, everybody. John Morris here, johnmorrisonline.com. Welcome back to another tech tutorial here on YouTube. This one, we're going to get in back into, you know, about once a month or so, I do these uh, freelance templates. So these are templates for common things that you might do for clients. They're designed to help you to be able to do these things much easier and much quicker then you might be able to do them otherwise. And I, I try to walk through not only the technical side of it, but also kind of the, the business side uh, and the marketing side of it. So you get an idea of what it is that your clients are ultimately going to be after so that you can then give that to them, make them really, really happy and be able to continue to get business from them. All right. So in this one, we're going to be talking about a sale template. And being that we're at the time of this recording, we're coming up, getting close to where we're going to start getting into the holiday season, back to school stuff, and then start getting into uh, Thanksgiving and Christmas and all that stuff. And we're going to be seeing all of these sales. This is something, this template that I'm going to go through today is something that if you're prepped and you're ready, you, you, you've you got the template, you've worked out how to use it, you've built different versions of this, put them in your portfolio. This is something that, again, I always try to show you opportunities, things that you can exploit in the market in a positive way to be able to earn you some business. This is one of those things that in, in the coming few months and every year around this time, uh, you can use these kinds of things to, to, to be able to... Uh, earn business from what every other business out there is going to be doing from what your clients are naturally going to be wanting. All right. So this is just kind of a simple sales page. This is something that someone might throw up. Let's say some client of yours or some business is is going to be running a Cyber Monday sale or a Black Friday sale or a, you know, after th or a a Thanksgiving sale or a uh, after Christmas sale or before Christmas sale or a New Year's sale or a back to school sale, whatever it is. This is a simple page that you can help them set up that will allow them to tell people about that sale uh, without having to build a super complex page and so forth. So this is very video driven. So I'm going to walk through then how we built this. So First off, you'll see at the top, usually you'll have some sort of imagery that'll be related to the, the industry that this is for. And we're in the tech industry, so I, I put a laptop up there. Usually your client will provide that with you, but we have this imagery up here. And then we have this headline. Now, typically with sales, unlike a lot of other scenarios where you're going to go uh, with some sort of benefit driven, you know, the rest of the year, the, the headline would be more benefit driven would be talking about what they're going to to get out of the product or so forth. Around this time, you really want to hit them hard with the actual sale itself because people get so caught up, their, their buying temperature is so high and they're actually out looking for deals. So the deal itself is the benefit. And so you want to hit them with that. Now I have Cyber Monday limited time sale. Now you could of course change this. It could be Cyber Monday 50% off sale or 80% off sale or you know $20 off sale or whatever it is you kind of you really want to emphasize that as a part of the headline how much they're going to be getting off what the what the discount is and so forth to really to make that nice and bold and clear for them so that's that's what we're doing in the headline here next we're just adding a little information get this blank you basically this is the offer you're telling them get this whatever it is get this widget for a special limited time discount or get this video series for a special limited time discount get this course for a special limited time discount you're just you're giving them the information of what the actual offer is here and then under here we have a little sub headline and we're saying this absolutely ends november 27th at 11 59 p.m eastern time so whatever the date that it ends, you'd put that over here. What you'll notice here is this block, we're really hammering home the scarcity that this is going to end. It's the natural scarcity. This sale will end, and if they don't do this now, then they're not going to get access to it. Never underestimate the power of scarcity in your marketing. Now, I'm not saying you should make up scarcity, and I'm not saying you should, you should put it there when it's not actually there. 
But a lot of these sales do have an end date. It's natural scarcity. And, and hammering on that can be very, very powerful. So we have, again, our date that this ends. And then over here, we would have a little counter. Now, I've actually left this agnostic in terms of the counter here because there's a number of different plugins out there and different scripts and so forth that you can use for a counter. You may have your favorite one. Whatever you end up using, you just install it. Uh, and then drop, usually there's a short code you can drop in here. So I've left that agnostic for you so you're not tied down to a counter. But you would wanna have a counter here that counts down the time of when this expires. That Again, that's really hammering home the scarcity here. All right, down below then really the bulk of this is going to be the video here. So the video is going to be what your, really should be what your client provides you and this is just going to explain the sale. It's going to be like, hey, we're, we're running this particular sale. Here's why you're doing it. Here's the details. Here's what you need to do in order to get access. And so your client would generally provide this. If they ask, for you, ask you for any input on this, the biggest piece of advice that I can give you is that this should really be focused on reason why type copy. And reason why type copy is, you know, if, if you say, well, I'm having a sale, a lot of people would be like, well, why are you having the sale? Now, in this case, we know it's Cyber Monday and so forth, but you have to go beyond that a little bit, right? So you have to say, look, this this time of year is, and you, the more shockingly honest you are, then the better. Like people know that your client is, that your client's customers know that they're a business. They know that they're trying to sell stuff. So the more you just open about that, if your client says something like, look, this is the time of year where we go from in the red to in the black. So we really have to make sure that we do a good job here. So we're willing to give you a massive discount just in order to, to, to have you purchase something from us. Right? Stuff like that, it, it rings true because it is true. It's the actual truth about what this is. And it's a powerful reason why you're doing this discount. All right, over here, we just add a little bit more information. So we're, we're kind of hammering on the scarcity again. You'll notice this whole thing is really about the, the huge discount coupled with the scarcity that it's going to end. So you, you really want people to leave this with this kind of splinter in their head of, gosh, if I don't take this massive discount before it ends, I'm going to miss out on it forever. So we're saying until XYZ date, get a crazy 50% off our leading project. We never do this and may never do it again. So grab it before we change our mind. Now, you'll obviously want to tailor that to the company. Your company may do this all the time. So you would want to tweak that text and so forth. A lot of times they may provide it to you, but you also want to be able to, to provide that yourself if need be. All right, and then we're hammering the special price here. Uh, here's the price. So this is, we're saying this is half off of the regular price. So the, normally the, the regular price would be about about thousand dollars. So they're saving $500. Now $500 for the product is still a decent amount, but getting 500 off is a really crazy discount. And then of course we have our add to cart button where you would link to whatever their, their cart is. If it's PayPal, if it's to checkout, or if it's their own little thing, whatever, you just link to whatever needs to be linked to here. And then we have some icons down here. So 60 day guarantee, maybe a 30 day guarantee, maybe a 90 day, whatever it is, you can put that down here. Secure checkout, assuming that's the case, it, it has to be pretty much by law and privacy protected. Of course, that pretty much there's tons of laws and rules around that. So we just put some icons down here to add to this. Now you could change these out and maybe you could put in some testimonials down here, or maybe you could put uh, something in here related to at like the as seen on icons that you see where they're as seen on Forbes and as seen on HGTV or whatever for your particular client. If they have some of those, that would be a good place to put uh, down here as well. All right. So that's, that's kind of the, the science behind this page, why this page is built the way that it is just some stuff in terms of using this template then you'll notice if we come in here uh, and come over here to the advanced side. So I have written a decent amount of CSS for this one, mainly around this headline up here to get this to do, to look like this, uh, a decent amount of CSS in here. But the nice thing is, is if you like the way this is, you can just leave it. The only time, reason you would need to change this is maybe you want to change out the colors. And so you can see down here for the heading, the H3 heading, we have a background color, which is this dark one. And then if we come down here, 
we have a background color for this lighter blue down here. So if you wanted to change those out, you would do that here. Um, but pretty much everything else color wise is available through the actual editor here. So all you have to do if you want to change this text, come in here and change it here. It's not going to affect, you know, if we do sale here or something like that, it's not going to affect or mess up the, the design here. Okay. So you can come in and edit it right in here, all point and click, drag and drop. This is for this kind of second area here. You'll notice here, this is where you can drop in your counter short code. If we come down here, the video is actually, uh, if we come up here to this column, the video is actually right here where you embed the video. So if they have it on Vimeo or YouTube or whatever, you can embed the video here. If you want to change, obviously you'll probably have to change the price. You can do that here. The button link down in here and so forth. There's some CSS that I've written uh, in the advanced tab up here in this first widget related to the button. So if you want to change the button color, that's in the CSS. And then of course you can change out these icons and so forth down here in the featured image area. So the nice thing about this is for you, it's really easy for you to edit, to, to get this template, come in and edit it for different clients. So it's all right here, kind of point and click. And if you don't need to change colors or anything like that, you could probably change this out in about five minutes. So imagine that for a second. Imagine you started marketing yourself like this, how quickly you could deliver these for clients and how many clients, maybe you, maybe you only charge 500 bucks for this, right? Let's say you charge 500 bucks for this page. Well, you could literally make this page in about five or 10 minutes for a client. I mean, even if you had to change out colors, it wouldn't take too much longer than that, maybe an hour at most. So you could do one of these pretty, you could do multiple of these per day. So you could really take on a lot of clients doing this and be able to handle it just fine and crank them out really, really easy. Obviously, you're going to make some money doing that, but the bigger benefit is it could be a really good intro into you getting those people then as more long-term clients for other maybe bigger projects. So this could be a nice entry-level type product that you offer to introduce clients to you. And it's the perfect kind of project because you can deliver on it very, very quickly. So quickly you will shock them that they'll, they'll be like, oh my gosh, that was fast. And that will set you up for them be coming back to you for repeat business and so forth. All right. So again, a very, very, uh, very, very handy template that you can use in a lot of different ways with clients. Now, as always, you probably wonder where you can get this. I make these the actual template itself available over on Patreon. You can uh, for supporting listeners at the freelance templates level. You get access to this template. And you also get access to all the other templates that I've uploaded. Now, one note on all that, if you do jump over there to get this template, uh, Patreon doesn't have a way for me to pin posts yet. That, that's one of the features that uh, I understand they're working on. And so when that happens, I'll have a pinned post with links to everything. But for now, once you sign up over on Patreon, you'll have kind of a home and it'll have a feed of everybody who you're supporting. Uh, if this is your first time on Patreon, then I'll be the only one on there. But it'll have a feed of everybody that you're supporting and their posts and the ones that you have access to. So you just need to scroll down. This one should be towards the top. Um, but the other ones that are available, there's several other ones that are available in there. You'll just have to scroll down uh, in the feed to find those. And along with all the source code and you're going to get access to exclusive courses. The freelance template level is the highest level. So you're going to get access to everything all the source code, all the courses, plus all the freelance templates and so forth. All right, so if you want to do that, you can head on over to johnmorrisonline.com slash Patreon, get access to this, get access to everything else, and then use this template to put a couple of these in your portfolio, change the colors a little bit, ch maybe change the wording and the videos and so forth, uh, some of the images and etc. and put a couple different ones in your portfolio, not made for anybody, just you make them and put them in your portfolio, and then when we start getting into back to school sales and Christmas and Black Friday and all that stuff, now you have these items in your portfolio you can pitch to people for these kinds of sales. Very, very powerful thing you can do. All right, again, head on over to johnmorrisonline.com slash Patreon 
to get access to the template. All right, that'll do it for this tech tutorial. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, be sure to like it so that I know that you like these. If you know somebody who could benefit from using this template, I'd appreciate it if you'd share it with them. And if you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe so that you never miss an episode. Thanks again for watching. Talk to you next time.